Hello, everybody. How are you doing this evening? Good. Welcome to Power 2. I'm Tay, and I'll be leading you through the next hour of your Power 2 practice. Um, we still have the mask ordinance in effect in the state of Colorado. If you feel it's unsafe for you to practice with a mask on or you have a condition where you shouldn't, only you can make that call within the four corners of your mat. Um, and under that exemption, I'm not going to wear a mask while I teach this evening. Um, today, we're going to do some heart opening, some back bending, some expansion through our front body. Um, I recently just watched a documentary talking about um, dreams and kind of explaining how they work. Um, and a lot of different like artists and um, great writers and um, creative people have gained a lot of inspiration from their dreams. And a kind of scientific reason behind why this happens is because when we dream, our prefrontal cortex shuts off. This is our like analytical self, our decision-making self, um, which, you know, it's important to honor the duality that lives within each of us. But sometimes our logic can get in the way of us letting our heart guide our path. Um, so we're just going to turn into some buttery, lovey little noodles tonight and let our hearts guide the way. So with that said, let's begin in child's pose. Take your knees wide apart. Guide your big toes to touch. Stretch your fingertips forward. Let your heart melt between your thighs towards your mat. Give yourself a couple breaths just to settle in. Appreciate how you showed up here tonight. First piece of living from our hearts and existing from that space of love is showing up with kindness for however our practice may look. I think a lot of times our analytical mind can jumpstart when we arrive here. We should be doing this. Our practice should look like this. Try to let those thoughts, the monkey mind, soften and just know that you're exactly where you need to be. Find a big breath in through your nose, fill up all the way. Open mouth, exhale. Let's take one more like this. Inhale. Big sigh. Feel your lips. Start to breathe in and out just through your nose for Ujjayi Pranayama, warrior's breath. This breath will help us build a little more heat in our bodies from the inside out. But no, open mouth exhales are always there for you. And you're welcome to stay right as you are if this feels good in your body. Otherwise, start to shift up through tabletop. Set up for puppy pose. Close your knees in a little tighter hip width. Walk your arms out forward towards the top of your mat. And ground your forehead down as you stack your hips over your knees. Maybe you drive your chin to the earth. Maybe you start to soften your heart down. You could tent your fingertips. Notice how the quality of your breath has shifted, if it has. Stay present here with yourself as you melt your chest down. Take a few more rounds of breath, deep intentional inhales and exhales. And with every breath out, let your heart sink just a little bit deeper, even if it's a millimeter. These look beautiful, y'all. One final round of breath to let yourself land, soften. Mindfully inhale your way through tabletop and start to find organic movement, anything that feels good. Friends joining us virtually, I'll give you a countdown for our playlist. Our first song is called Get To You. We'll press play in three, two, one. Breathe just a little more loudly with sound. Good. Inspire the person across the room from you with your breath. Our breath is also a gateway to connecting to our heart space, living from our love, our emotion, rather than our minds. It helps you to drop into here and now rather than outside of the space, past, future. A few more rounds of breath on your own, and we'll sync up together. Beautiful, friends. Start to come back to neutral table. Create length through your spine. Inhale, cow pose. Drop your belly. Lift your gaze and your tailbone up. 
Exhale, cat, curl into yourself. Gaze towards your navel, puff up. Inhale, cow pose, drop your core. Peel your collarbones apart from one another. Exhale, cat, press down, dome your back, squeeze. Inhale, cow pose, once more, drop down, open. Exhale, cat, contract, hug up and in. Nice, Kim. Inhale, come back to neutral. Strengthen through your belly. Reach your right arm forward, then kick your left leg straight back. Final balance. Knit your ribs and your hips a little closer towards each other. Feel the activation of your core. Nice, Em. Take a deep breath in. Reach. Exhale, cat curl. Hug your elbow towards your knee. Dome your back even more. Inhale, lengthen spinal balance. Two more like this. Exhale, curl. Inhale, stretch. Reach. Exhale, cat curl. Hug. Inhale, spinal balance and pause. You're always welcome to stay here or start to bend your left knee. Reach your right hand back. Grab the inner edge of your foot for tiger pose. Start to kick up, squeeze your left glute. The muscles of your back, maybe shift your gaze up to challenge your balance. Micro bend your left elbow to strengthen your foundation to the earth. Stay for one more inhale, these are gorgeous. Good, exhale to spinal balance, release. Keep your left leg lifted, ground your right palm. Tuck your right toes under, and then float your right knee just a couple inches off the floor. Fire up through your quad, your belly for three, two, three-legged dog, inhale. You're welcome to bend your hip, open, counter stretch. Do anything that feels nice. Then square your hips, straighten your left leg, deep breath in. Exhale, knee to nose, shift forward. Inhale, three legs. Exhale, lunge, step, find some organic movement. Maybe you shift side to side, forward, back, wake up through your hamstring, your hip flexor. Really beautiful movements, y'all. When we find intuitive movement, again, that's a space where we can connect to ourselves inwardly, not up here in our mind. <sighs> Pause in your lunge. Drop your right knee. Exhale to half splits. Flex your left toes towards your nose. Tent your fingertips. Pull your heart open. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, soften your torso down. Two more together. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, melt. Last round, inhale. Exhale, drop your heart low. Inhale, lead with your chest lift up and open. Shift forward, inhale, one-legged half lift. Kick your left or rather right leg back behind you. Rotate your right hip tip down. It's still early, no need to push too deep. Find one more juicy breath in here. Exhale is ragdoll. Take your feet hips width or wider to the top of your mat. Bend your knees a lot. Any arm variation, opposite hand to opposite elbow, chest expansion, basket grip. Nice breath, y'all. I'm gonna stay here for one more inhale. Beautiful choices. With control, exhale your hands to the mat. Toe heel your feet together to touch. A little bit of space between your heels. Inhale, halfway lift. Elongate your spine through the crown of your head. Exhale, fold, tuck your chin to your chest, compress. Inhale, mountain, press down through your feet, reach all the way to stand. Take a moment here. Soften your shoulders. Scoop your core in and puff your heart forward towards the mirror. Take a deep inhale, lift. Exhale, cactus back bend, squeeze your glutes, open your chest, look up. Inhale, mountain, rise. Two more, exhale, cactus. Inhale, reach, squeeze. Last round, exhale. Inhale, rise, mountain. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, high plank and hold. Stack your shoulders right above your wrists. Micro bend your elbows just a little to fire up the muscles of your arms. Dome your back. Think again, super angry cat. Yeah, that looks great. Yeah, that was a really good hiss. I'm proud of that. <laughs> super realistic. Good. Pause here for one more inhale, squeeze. Shift forward, exhale, lower halfway, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog, flip your feet, pull your heart open, hover your thighs up. Exhale, downward facing dog. Good, inhale, shift forward, back to high plank, and then drop to tabletop. We'll set up spinal balance, second side. Begin to extend your left arm forward, right leg straight back. Pause here first to gain your composure, your strength. Squeeze your core, gaze slightly forward, inhale. Nice adjust, exhale, cat curl. Inhale, spinal balance, stretch. Exhale, curl and squeeze. One more time, inhale. Exhale, hug in. Inhale, spinal balance and hold. Stay if you did before or bend your right knee, tiger pose. Reach behind you, then kick up. 
Grip the ground with your right fingertips to create strength. Nice, Ash. Flare your heart open. See if you can kick one more inch up. Inhale. With control, exhale, spinal balance. Keep your right leg as it is. Drop your left hand. Tuck your left toes. Float your left knee and hold. Squeeze just for three. For two. Inhale, three-legged dog. Really nicely done. Find what felt good on the first side here. Open it up. Rotate. Or just stay as you are. Good. Inhale, square your hip. Kick your right leg straight. Exhale, knee to nose. Shift forward. Dome your back. Big squeeze. Inhale, three-leg dog. Exhale, lunge, step. Take time for yourself to move. Notice what might feel good on this side that didn't on the first. What might be different? Where are you feeling sticky or open? Right, connect to the sensations of your body. Get it, Erica. Start to come back through to a lunge, then drop your left knee. Exhale, half split. Shift your hips over your left knee. Flex your right toes towards your nose. Inhale, lengthen, tent your fingers. Think like a half lift. Exhale, lead with your heart. Melt yourself down. Two more. Inhale, lift. Exhale, soften. Last time. Inhale, press. Exhale, drop your chest low. Inhale, shift forward. One-legged half lift. Create length through your torso as you kick your left heel back. Find strength through the muscles of your leg. Activate. Squeeze. One more inhale as you are. Exhale, forward fold, feet to touch. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, mountain root and rise. Good, this time press your palms together. Exhale, bend your elbows, thumbs towards the nape of your neck. Inhale, re-extend, keep your palms together, really press them tightly. Exhale, bend, lift your chest a little more. Good, again, inhale, reach up. Good. Exhale, squeeze your core. A little more bend. Heart up, gaze up. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, high to low plank. Ground your palms. Find your flow. Beautiful control. Inhale, up dog. Savor the back bend. Open your chest. Exhale, down dog. Hips high. Let's take a deep breath in. Fill up. Big sigh. Let it go. Good. Inhale, gaze forward towards the top of your space. Exhale, travel there. Walk step, maybe hop. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair pose. Bend your knees deeply. Reach your arms high. Pause here. Shift your weight back into your heels. Maybe float your toes up to create more grounding. Then scoop your core in, just like we did in spinal balance. Then drop your tailbone low to the flow. Good, nice adjust. Inhale, reach. Exhale, chair plane. Good, couple more. Inhale, chair. Exhale, plane. Get lower through your hips. Inhale, chair. Exhale, plane. Inhale, chair pose. Listen for the change. Press your palms together. Bend your elbows to the nape of your neck. Notice if you start to round. Lift your chin away from your chest. Nice adjustments, y'all. That was awesome. Keep your arms as they are. Open your heart. Half chair, ribs towards your thighs. Sink your booty a little deeper. Parallel your thighs to the earth. Keep pressing your head into your thumbs. Open through your triceps, your chest. One more breath. Stay for your exhale. Inhale, reach your arms forward. Half chair. Inhale your left knee up. One leg mountain. Oh, take a second here. Level out your hips. Scoop your core in. Flex your left toes up. One more inhale to lift. Exhale, open twist to the left. Option to bring your right hand to your outer left thigh for a little assist in the rotation of your spine. Inhale, lift tall through the crown of your head. Exhale, once more, twist a little deeper. Inhale, swim back to one leg, mountain lift. Exhale, standing splits, like you're moving through honey. Glide down, connect your fingertips to your mat. Kick your left leg a little bit higher. Now, if you want some exploration here, go for it. Maybe open your hips. Maybe play with balance. Take one or both hands away from your mat. When we follow and trust, Without second guessing, without thinking, that's when our heart space lives and exists through us. Gorgeous, y'all. One more breath right here. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, find your flow. Ground your palms, step or float. Inhale to lift. Exhale, downward facing dog. All right, inhale, gaze forward. 
exhale, travel to the top of your space. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, chair pose. Sink low, reach high. Again, take a moment to set it up. Scissor your thighs together as if they had a block between them. Then scoot your knees back just a hair. Yeah, nice adjust. Inhale, press your palms together. Exhale, elbows bend. Bring your thumbs to the nape of your neck. Lift your chin away from your chest. Yes. I feel. Now exhale, half chair with your arms as they are. Ribs towards your thighs. Continue to lift your elbow tips up. Use your strength. Really gorgeous. Get it, Allie. Good. Now stay for your exhale. Keep your torso, your legs. Inhale, just reach your arms forward. Good, then lift up one leg mountain, right knee high. Flex your toes, hug your core in to stabilize. Lift through the crown of your head like someone was pulling you up like a puppet master of the universe. One more inhale. Exhale, open twist to the right. Option for little assist with your left hand this side. Good. Inhale, create some lift. Exhale, deep and twist, use your core. Inhale, one leg mountain, float through center. Exhale, standing split, smooth, buttery transition down towards your mat. Now explore, honor what you need here. Listen to your body. Drown out the sounds of your thoughts. Just notice what feels good. One more inhale. Exhale, forward fold. Good option to stay in your fold or crow pose. Ground your hands, toe heel your feet out a little bit wider. Drive your knees up towards your armpits. Malasana is also an awesome option here. We've got a few breaths. Dome through your back, scoop your core up and in. Think thigh master, scissor your thighs up and in. Nice Shannon, so good. Stay for your inhale. Exhale, step or jump back. Move through your flow, whatever that looks like. Good, exhale, downward facing dog. Find an expansive breath in, fill up. Let it out, exhale. Ha. Beautifully done, y'all. Let's keep building. Inhale, lift your right leg high. Exhale, knee to nose, curl in, shift forward. Inhale, re-extend your leg. Exhale, right knee, right shoulder, little tap. Inhale, three-leg dog lift. Exhale, twist towards your left shoulder, squeeze your side. Inhale, three-leg lift. Exhale, lunge, step forward. Inhale, rise, crescent, and pause. Drive your left heel over the ball mound of your back foot to press your left hip forward. Drive your core in, reach through your fingertips. Hug through your inner thighs to support your lunge. Good, now inhale, press your palms together. Exhale, bend your left knee, bend your elbows, look up, little back bend. Hold this first round to really feel it. Flare your ribs up, but squeeze your core in. Now breath to movement, inhale, reach. Good, palms together, exhale. Two more, inhale, send it up. Exhale, one more, inhale. Exhale, take it low, bend your left knee. This time, inhale, warrior three torso, straighten your left leg, reach through your fingertips, just like our half chair, create length and strength through your entire spine. Shift your right knee over your ankle, stay low. Nice adjust, one more, inhale. Exhale, warrior two, slice open to the left, settle into your pose. Maybe dance it out for a second. <sighs> Deep and controlled inhales and exhales, then settle in. Scoop your thighs up and in, hug your core tight. Stay for your breath out. Inhale, reverse warrior, stay low but lean back. Shift your right knee just a little bit closer to the top of your mat, get it, Kira. Find an inhale to lengthen. Exhale, extended side angle, shift forward and down. Bring your right arm towards your right inner thigh or on top of it. Use arm to thigh connection to spiral open. Think almost like a little baby back bend. Gaze up towards the sky. Beautiful, Margie. One more exhale here. Inhale, reverse triangle. Straighten your front leg, little release for your hip flexor. Lift your right hip up as you reach through your fingertips. Last inhale. Exhale, take your hands to your mat, flow it out. Really nice feel. Exhale, down dog. Beautiful choices and intuitive options. All right, let's move to the left. Inhale, sweep your left leg high. Exhale, knee to your nose, scoop and shift forward. Inhale, re-extend. Exhale, tap your left shoulder, use your side body. Inhale, three leg dog. 
Exhale, twist to the right. Inhale, re-extend, three legs. Exhale, lunge with control, step by your left thumb. Inhale, high crescent, rise and reach. Give yourself the same attention to detail as you did on the first side. Press your left hip back, drive your right hip forward, and then your tailbone down. Maybe bend your right knee just slightly. Good. Inhale, press your palm. Exhale, bend your elbows and your right knee. Look up, hold this first one just to commit this posture to memory. Can you lead with your heart space? Lift from your clavicle, your sternum. Pause, exhale. Let's flow it out. Inhale, reach. Exhale, drop it low. Two more. Inhale, stretch. Exhale, sink. Last one. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, warrior three, torso, and hold. Straighten through your right leg. Feel the power from your right heel all the way out through the crown of your head, through your fingertips. You are strong. Just take one more inhale right here. Exhale, warrior two. Open it up. Settle in. Align your heel with your back arch and hug your shoulder blades together. Drop them down away from your ears. Gorgeous, y'all. These look super strong. One more exhale as you are. Inhale, reverse warrior. Sweep your left arm high. Shift your left knee forward. Feel your quad light up. Lengthen as you inhale. Exhale, extended side angle. Shift forward with long side body. Spiral your right shoulder on top of your left, your right hip on top of your left. Stay committed to your strength. You got it. One more exhale. Inhale, reverse triangle. Reach, straighten your front leg. Micro bend your front knee and lift your hip up one more inch. Stay for your inhale. Exhale, take your hands to the mat. Find your flow. Good. Exhale, downward facing dog. Find a juicy breath in. Let it go. Exhale. Ah. All right, y'all. This is our flow. We're going to add on just a little bit and move rest to movement slightly quicker. Let's take one more inhale together. Get big. Send it out. Ah. All right. Inhale. Lift your right leg to the sky. Exhale. Knee to nose. Inhale. Three legs. Exhale, right knee, right tricep, pause, left windshield, wipe it out. Across to your left, back to your right. Exhale, puff up through your back. Keep the cat-like sensation going for four, three, two, one. Inhale, three leg dog lift. Exhale, lunge, step. Inhale, high crescent, rise up. Press your palms. Exhale, bend your knees and elbows. One more time. Inhale, reach. Exhale. Inhale, full warrior three. Take flight this time. Front row friends, maybe hands to heart. Do you. Rotate your left hip down. Kick through your left heel. Scoop your core up and in. <sighs> Stay here for one more full round of breath. In. Exhale, step that crescent airplane torso. <sighs> Inhale, crescent reach up. Exhale, warrior two. Open to the left. Inhale, reverse warrior. Stay low, lean back. Exhale, extended side angle and pause. You're welcome to stay or half moon. Inhale, shift forward onto your right leg. Flex your left toes towards your nose. Lift your left heel a little bit higher. Notice where your thoughts have gone. Can you just exist and how will this posture feel? Give yourself permission to lead and live from your heart. One more full round of breath. Lightly step back. Inhale, reverse triangle. Reset, lengthen. Exhale, cartwheel down to a lunge and pause. Ground your left hand. Inhale, easy twist to the right. Stay or side plank. Roll to the knife edge of your left foot. Stack your right foot on top. You can always drop your left knee down for modified side plank. <sighs> Press your hips up. Big squeeze. Maybe play with lifting your right leg high. Good. Stay with your inhale. Exhale, high to low plank or skip it. We meet downward facing dog. Good. Exhale, your hips up and back. Take a rich breath in. Sigh it out. Gorgeous breath. Inhale, your left leg high. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, lift. Exhale, left knee, left shoulder and pause. Windshield wipes to the right. Back to the left, side to side. Puff up, squeeze your belly. Here's 
four, just three. Last two, and one. Inhale, re-extend. Exhale, lunge, step. Inhale, high crescent, press your palms. Exhale, bend your knee and elbows. One more time, inhale, high crescent. Exhale, bend, open your chest. Inhale, warrior three, take flight, launch forward. Pause here, squeeze your belly, kick through your right heel. Soften your left knee just a little. Spiral your hips level with one another. Gorgeous, y'all. One more, inhale as you are. Exhale, crescent airplane torso, step back. Inhale, high crescent, sweep up. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse warrior. Exhale, extended side, stay or play. Inhale to half moon pose. You can always use a water bottle, a prop, anything that you have to help find balance. Flex your toes to activate. Tight is light. The tighter we squeeze, the more buoyant our body becomes in the air. Gorgeous, y'all. One more full round of breath. Wherever you are is exactly where you need to be. Lightly step. Inhale, reverse triangle. Reach. Exhale, hands to the mat. Lunge. Ground your right palm. Inhale, easy twist to the left. Stay or side plank as you exhale, rotate over. Press your hips up like a giant rainbow. Squeeze and press into the earth. Option to float your left leg up. Scissor your thighs as you squeeze. One more inhale. Exhale, flow it out or skip it. Honor where you're at. <sighs> Let's take a deep breath in. Big sigh, let it go. All right, one more time through our flow, adding on just a little bit more. Inhale your right leg high. Exhale, knee to nose. Pause with your knee to your nose. Elevators to the center of your mat. Drop your knee low, then back to your nose. Lower, exhale, lift. Inhale, lower, pull. For four, three, two, one. Inhale, three legs. Exhale, lunge, step with control. Inhale, high crescent, palms together. Exhale, lower. One more time. Inhale, lift. Palms press. Exhale, down. Inhale, warrior three. Launch forward. All right, y'all. You have the option to stay as you are or crunch. Elbows in, left knee in, just like spinal balance. Inhale, reach. Warrior three. Exhale, curl. Inhale, reach. One more time. Curl. Good. Inhale, warrior three. Pause for your exhale. Listen for the change. Inhale, one leg mountain. Good. Exhale, figure four. Drop it down for a second. Cross your left ankle on your right thigh, hands to heart. One more round of breath. Good. Nice reset. Inhale, one leg mountain. Listen for the change. Exhale, twist left. Swim it down. Half moon pose. Right fingers to the earth. Left hand up. Stay or sugar cane. Bend your left knee. Reach for your foot with your left hand. Similar to tiger pose, just a little different. If you have the bind, press your hips towards the mural, your feet towards the front door. <sighs> really nice, y'all. One more round of breath. Return to half moon if you journey to Chopasana or sugar cane. Step back, inhale, reverse triangle. Set up for full triangle. Shift your hips to the left, reach forward. Bring your right hand towards your shin, maybe your big toe, maybe to float or a block. Give yourself a moment to reset. Spiral your hips open. <sighs> Gorgeous, y'all. Last inhale right here. Exhale, ground your left hand. Shift your left foot forward. Set up standing splits. Lift your left leg high. We got some more options. You can stay or exhale, jiva squat. Chamber your knee. Inhale, kick it up. Exhale, jiva. Maybe you stay here or handstand hops. Get a little play time in. Maybe you lift your hands off the earth. Play with your balance. Nice, Marta. Really good. Straight elbows. Good. One more round of breath. <sighs> good. Slowly step back to high plank. Ground your left hand. Side plank open towards the right side of the room. Building on. You can stay right here. Maybe lift your top foot. If you do, then bend your top foot. Step it behind your front leg. Wild thing. Press your hips up. Let your top arm drop back. Squeeze through your back body. Open through your chest. 
One more breath. Slowly unwind, high to low, find your flow. Downward facing dog. We got one more side of our flow left, then rest is coming. Take a juicy breath in. Let some shit go. Ah. Good. Inhale. This time, maybe a hit. Good. I see you, Em. Inhale. Lift your left leg high. Exhale. Knee to nose. Curl. Elevators to the center of your mat. Down and up. Tap your knee, then squeeze as you exhale. Lower lift. These look super strong. Nice, Michelle. Three. Two, one, inhale, three leg dog. Exhale, lunge, step forward. Inhale, high crescent, rise, palms press. Exhale, bend, elbows and right knee. One more time, inhale, stretch. Exhale, bend. Inhale, full warrior three, launch. Stay or curl, elbows in, right knee towards your nose, tiny ball. Inhale, warrior three. Exhale, crunch. Inhale, stretch. One more crunch, curl. Inhale, warrior three, stay for your exhale. Inhale your right knee high. Exhale, figure four, cross your right ankle on your left side. Give yourself a moment, press your palms together, sink your booty down low. Inhale, back to one leg mountain. Exhale, twist right and swim it down. Half moon pose with control, tuck your left fingers or find a prop. Stay or sugar cane. Bend your right knee. Press your hips towards the white wall. Squeeze your back body to open your chest. A little back bend, right? Lead with your heart. Good. We trace your steps to half moon. Lightly step. Inhale, reverse triangle. Rise and lengthen. Exhale is full triangle. Shift your hips to the right. Sass and lean up and over. Spiral your hips and your heart open. Feel the side body stretch, the expansion through your front line. Last breath in. Exhale your right hand down. Readjust your right foot. Then inhale to standing splits. Lift your right leg high. Stay here or exhale. Jiva, get low. Inhale, split. Exhale, Jiva. Keep going or play. Kick it up. Ground your palms. Grip the mat with your fingertips. Find true expression of your heart wherever you go. These are beautiful, y'all. Good. Make your way to split and find your way through to high plank. Step it back. Ground your right palm. Side plank open to the mural. Left arm high. Stay or float your left foot. Then bend your left knee. Step it behind your right leg. Press your hips up. Wild thing. Expand through your chest. Squeeze your back. Elevate from your sternum up. Last breath. These look so good. Find your way back through. Option to flow or skip it. Find your way to downward facing dog. Breath in through your nose. Tongue out. Let it go. Ha. One more. Inhale. Tongue out. Send it out. Ha. Come down to your knees. Woo. How we doing, y'all? Oh, so spicy. So good. Give yourself a sec to towel off. Grab some water. Mm. All right, beautiful friends. We're going to do just one, one movement for our core. Just one. Just one today. It's just, yeah, my treat to you. Um, we're going to do Sphinx roll-ups. To continue again, working the strength and the spaciousness of our heart space, but also our back core as well as our front core. Um, if you know these, you're welcome to hop in. We'll take six super slow. If you need a demo, I'm here for you. We keep the tops of our feet flat, and this is a really controlled movement. I press through my feet first, then I lift my shins, my knees, my thighs, my hips. I curl. Notice my hands and feet don't move. I'm just piking my hips up with the strength of my front body. Then I lower the same way. Tops of feet, shins. Knees, thighs, hips, core, heart, open. And then repeat for six super slow times. As slow as humanly possible. I want you to feel each contraction of every muscle that you are working while this is happening. Right, that mindfulness to the sensuality of our bodies, that sense 
connection, right? That's living from the heart. Deep breaths while you do it. Exhale as you lift your hips. Slow, controlled inhale to lower. Good. Really good control. Nice job, Jen. <clears throat> Margie, take your elbows in a little more and then lift up to your forearms. So like here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Yep. The elbows down. Yep. Again, there is no rush, but once you've made it through your sixth round, uh, crocodile pose. Cross your palms, elbows wide, forehead flat, like a little belly down Shavasana. Just the light at the end of the tunnel, you know? Give yourself a second. <clears throat> Good. If it feels good, maybe you bring your hands even by your side. Gaze one direction or the other. Let your heart come flat to your mat. Right? Feel your heart beat against the earth. It's a really beautiful reminder of how strong our heart space really is. We'll begin to flip over like a pancake, just on your back, little flop. And then we'll set up for bridge and wheel pose. We'll take three sets this evening. I'll cue bridge first, then wheel second. If you want a different variation, different pose altogether, honor that space. For bridge, bend your knees, hips width distance apart, plant your feet down. Ground your hands next to your hips, flatten to the earth. And then inhale, lift your hips and your heart up towards the sky. Lightly tone the muscles of your back body to elevate your chest. But then guide your chin away from your heart as you elevate and open. Hug your shoulder blades together. A few more breaths as you are. One more inhale out right here. Then exhale slowly lower one bone at a time until your hips meet the earth. Fall and bridge. Just let your knees knock together. Keep your feet apart to reset for a breath. And we'll come into wheel pose or more bridge if that's your thing. Same setup in our lower body. This time, flip your fingers towards your shoulders, palms flat, elbows up. Inhale, press into your hands and feet to lift your torso up. Maybe stop on the crown of your head and then readjust your hand placement. Press your heart through your shoulders towards the mirrors behind you. This is not only bending through our back, right, but we're stretching through our lats, our chest. Open mouth, exhale, surrender to the process, to the feeling. Two more rounds. <sighs> Lightly tuck your chin to your chest and lower your shoulders, upper back, middle back, then lowest back last. A breath to reset. And then when you are ready, six rounds of breath on your own in wheel or bridge, your choice. Only you know when you've taken your sixth and final breath. Awesome layers, y'all. Really beautiful expression. <sighs> nice, Marcia. <sighs> Supta Baddha Konasana or Fallen Bridge or any other pose. Bring one hand to your heart, one hand to your belly. Right, our breath and our heart space. The two work in tandem to keep us in existence, but also so present. Right, meditation, the practice of mindfulness is just about noticing what's happening right now. Not letting our mind take us from before to the future, but right in this moment, where are you at? How do you feel? Know that you are strong, you are incredible, and always enough, no matter what. That's living from the heart. <clears throat> Begin to gently close your knees if they're apart. Scoop yourself up into a ball of love and appreciation. Squeeze tight. Maybe a gentle rock side to side. 
then rock and roll forward and back until you get momentum to sit up and then flip around to the front. We've got a couple breaths to get to down dog. slowly start to make our way to down dog. We've got a little bit more flow building on to kind of similarly what we were doing earlier. Continue to open through our front body to expand, to breathe. See if you can stay fully mindful, fully present in your heart space as we move through our last breath to movement a little bit quicker. Take a deep breath in. Open mouth, exhale. Good, inhale, lift your right leg towards the sky. Exhale, lunge, step forward. Inhale, standing splits. Reach up, kick your left leg high. Exhale, jiva squats. Inhale, splits. One more, exhale, jiva, and hold. Bring your hands to your heart space. Trust that you've got this. Balance on your right leg. Stay in ground for one more exhale. Inhale, one leg mountain, rise. Reach your arms up and extend little different transition. Exhale, twist to the left and find dancer's pose. Capture your left foot behind you from the inside edge as you lift your heart up. Square your left shoulder forward once you've captured and extend. All right, we're gonna try this two more times. Gently release your foot, inhale, one leg mountain. Exhale, twist left, capture your foot, dancer. Good, really nice, y'all. One more, inhale, one leg mountain. Exhale, dancer, twist. Find one more inhale, kick up. Option to keep the bind, drop it down, sugar cane, right hand to the earth. We've been here before. Always the option for half moon instead. Couple more breaths. Slowly find half moon. Step back, inhale, star pose. Find a dance, a wiggle movement, or a standing power pose. Reach, ground through your feet, lengthen up. <sighs> Take one more inhale here. Exhale, horse, get low. Bring your hands to your thighs. We'll find some twists. Press into the heels of your wrists and lock out your elbows to help traction your low back. Let your hips drop. Inhale, exhale, twist your right shoulder to whatever direct top of your mat or back of your mat. Yep, thank you. Inhale to center. Exhale to the top. Inhale, lift. Again, exhale to the back. Inhale. Last time. Inhale through center, find star. To your arms, turn your toes. Exhale, wide leg fold. Give yourself space to explore here. We'll be here a little bit longer this set. If you want to play, to shift, to twist, to prone frog, anything in between. Follow your intuitive sense. <clears throat> Keep your logical mind out of it. You know, serve pose. Pop up. Yeah. <gasps> Gorgeous, Allie. Last couple rounds of breath. Start to bring your hands back beneath your shoulders. Inhale, lengthen little mini half lift. Exhale, pyramid to the top of your mat. This one's for you, Alex. Step your left foot forward and out. Square your hips, pull your right hip back. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, melt your chest down. Two more together, inhale. Exhale, fold. One more, inhale. Exhale, fold and hold. You're welcome to stay or revolved pyramid. Ground your left hand down, reach your right arm up and open. Maybe to the inside or outside of your right foot or on a prop. Work to keep your hips level. So this is a beautiful place to stay or shift your left hand forward. Inhale, revolve, half moon. Kick your left leg up, keep your twist. You could stay here or bend your left knee, reach your right hand back, bound, revolve, half moon. But wait, there's more. 
you can stay or inhale revolve dancer reach up kick your left leg yeah oh geez get it marks are really good one more round of breath whatever layer you find yourself in get it nedra for my friends lifted come back with control bring your knees together drop down we meet pyramid, then we all round our hands. Step back, high to low plank, find your flow. All right, y'all, one more side to rock it. Inhale, lift your left leg up. Exhale, lunge. Inhale, standing splits, lift your right leg high. Exhale, Jiva squat, take it low. One more, inhale. Exhale, Jiva and hold. Float your hands off the earth, fire up your left leg. One more breath out where you are. <sighs> inhale, one leg mountain, lift, flex your toes. Good, exhale, twist to the right, dancer's pose. Catch the inside edge of your foot. Let yourself land in this pose for this first round before we flow it out. Rotate your right hip forward slightly. Kick through your back body, open through your chest. Now let's flow. Inhale, one leg mountain, release, come back up. Exhale, twist to dancer, little kick and capture. One more, inhale, one leg, rise with control. Last time, exhale, kick, dancer. Then gently start to float it down, sugar cane or half moon. Embrace the journey of the shakes and wobbles. That's how we grow. Learn to love the moments of imperfection, right? That's living from the heart. One more breath. We all meet in half moon, then inhale, rise to star, reach up. Oh, good, this time turn your toes forward, arms T right away, wide leg fold, exhale, swim it down. Not here for as long, a few rounds of breath. Start to come back to your fold. Inhale, little mini half lift. Exhale, pivot to the top, set up pyramid. Pop your right foot up and out. Bring your feet to train tracks just to help your hips. Pull your left hip back. Inhale, lift your chest. Exhale, lower down, melt. Two more together. Inhale. Exhale, soften. Last one. Inhale. Exhale, fold and stay here or twist. Plant your right hand, spiral your left arm up. Move from your belly button. You can stay right here rooted in pyramid or shift your right palm forward. Revolved half moon, lift your right leg up. Level your hips, squeeze your core. Stay or bend your right knee. Reach your left hand to the inner edge of your foot, big toe side. Stay or big inhale, rise, revolve, dancer. You can make this as much of a back bend as you want, but lead with your chest open and then kick. Let yourself land in the space that you are in for two more breaths. Friends elevated, slowly come back, bring your knees together, plant your right hand, then your left, step back pyramid, and then palms down high plank. Final flow of class, take it, leave it, do something else all together, it's up to you. <sighs> Exhale, downward facing dog. <sighs> Find a rich breath in, big sigh. <sighs> Inhale your right leg high. Exhale, half pigeon, guide your knee wide outside of your right wrist, pull your right ankle forward. If you know you want a different pose, please go for it. Otherwise, you're welcome to stay lifted. We've done a lot of heart opening if you'd like to explore king pigeon, mermaid, or soften it out, sleep your pigeon down. Let your heart surrender a little closer to the front of your mat towards your right leg, your shin. I think a lot of times, our society can push us to favor our analytical minds. It's good to have a plan. It's good to know what you're doing. And the cool thing in air quotes about 
the analytical mind is, right, we get to skip the feeling and just go for what's happening, what we want to do. But when we live from our hearts, right, we create a roadmap with love. Give yourself the opportunity to feel it all. That's how we learn and grow and shift. Five more breaths here. Gently begin to journey back up if you're still down. Tuck your left toes, guide your hips high, counter stretch, maybe flip dog. Okay. Begin to come back to down dog as you're ready. And we'll set up our left side. Inhale your left leg high. Exhale, half pigeon. Guide your left knee wide. Parallel your shin forward as much as you comfortably can. Stay lifted, explore similar spaces, or surrender. Five more breaths. Slowly start to come back. Walk your hands in, tuck your toes. Three leg, down dog, flip dog. Take a deep breath in. Big sigh. Make your way through to a seat, and then lie all the way down onto your belly. Next few breaths are yours to take what you need to seal in your time here. Last chance to intuitively live from your heart space. What feelings do you seek? What can you honor? And if that's straight to Shavasana, then lie down and take up that space. feel complete and only you will know when take your final rest corpse pose this is the space where we really are able to tap into that inner guidance living from our heart space a good way to tell if that's what you're following is a softness it's the light whispers, the kind words to yourself. Our analytical mind can be a little more harsh, a little more direct. Follow the softness. I'll let you know when it's time to wake up.
feel drawn at all to stay still and endure a bit longer, please do. So if you're ready for recurring, you can just move your fingers and toes slowly. Until you create larger movement. And then a full body stretch. Bend your knees softly, roll to one side, use your arms up to low. And keep your eyes closed and come all the way up to your comfortable seat with your hands at your heart. <clears throat> Thank you for showing up tonight. The more that we practice listening for the love, the softness, right? That's when we're able to kind of channel that energy and create effortless decisions. I think when we exist from our analytical mind, it feels, things can feel forced, things can feel intense. But when we practice this connection, right, it's just easy, it makes sense. So thank you for doing the work. Thank you for being here and showing up as bright and beautiful as always. Take your thumbs to your third eye, sit tall. We bow in gratitude. Namaste. Thanks, friends. You guys did a beautiful job tonight. If you have any questions or feedback, I'm always here to listen and to hopefully have some answers, but mostly not. Um, we have a lot of cool things happening at the studio. Um, we just launched our 300 hour program. So we're very excited about it. It's open to students and teachers as well. Um, our next open module is Reiki with Erin, the 15th of this month. Um, Reiki is an energetic practice that works um, with all kinds of stuff, chakras, bandhas, um, but different ways of kind of connecting to that heart space, right? So if you're interested in practicing more, learning more about that, just let me know. It's open to students. That's all. I'll see you guys next time. Have a good one. Goodbye, friends at home. We'll see you next time.